everybody my name is amit and you are watching aptitude 360 online uh, uh this is uh, video number 2 in the series of finding out last digits of numbers like these uh if you have not seen the first video go over here or go in the description box but make sure that you have seen that video kyunki humne wahi pe sari ke sari concept building kari thi uh what i'm going to do is in this video i am going to talk about the cyclicity of 6 7 8 and 9 in the previous video we talked about the cyclicity of 2 3 4 and 5 uh, so let us uh, find out what is the cyclicity of 6 so 6 is to part 1 is coming out as 6 6 is to part 2 is 36 and how about 6 is to part 3 uh, this is nothing but 2 1 6 and then 6 is to part 4 is coming out as how much that's going to be 1 2 1 2 9 6 so i would say this uh 6 is to par 6 is to par any number the digit at unit place will always be 6 it cannot be anything else and this is what we saw in the last video that 5 is to par anything was nothing but 5 so cyclicity of 5 is 1 and the cyclicity of 6 is 1 now so can i say can i say this Uh, 6 is to power 83. What is the digit at the unit place? I would say this is 6. And how about 16 is to power 82? What is the digit at unit place? I would again be saying 6 because this one does not matter. And 6 is to power an even number. हमारे को क्या देगा वहाँ पे? हमारे को देगा वो 6, which is which is the cyclicity. So this is very simple, right? अच्छा वाला problem निकल के आएगा when we will be talking about cyclicity of cyclicity of 7 so by now everybody should be understanding as to how we can find out cyclicity of of a number yahan pe kya aa gaya bhai 7 is to power 1 that is 7 and then you have got 7 is to power 2 which is which is 49 what did what happened this number is 49 and 7 is to power 3 is coming out as what 343 and 7 is to power 4 is 24 जीरो वन अगर किसी भी ऑर्ड नंबर की साइक्लिसिटी चेक कर रहे हो आप और अगर यूनिट प्लेस पे वन आ जाए तो व्हाट इज गोना बी द डिजिट व्हाट इज गोना बी द लास्ट प्लेस ओवर हियर इन सेवन इज टू पार फाइव नाउ ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस टू फोर जीरो वन इन टू सेवन द डिजिट एट यूनिट प्लेस विल बी नथिंग बट वन सो ओवर हेयर दिस इज कमिंग आउट एज वन सेवन इज टू पार सिक्स वट इज गोना बी द डिजिट एट यूनिट प्लेस प्रॉबेबली दिस इज नाइन एंड सेवन इज टू पार सेवन अगेन आई वुड से दिस इज नथिंग बट थ्री एंड सेवन इज टू पार एट दैट इज कमिंग आउट एज एज वन सो वट इज द साइक्लिसिटी ऑफ सेवन द साइक्लिसिटी ऑफ सेवन इज कमिंग आउट एज एज फोर वापस मैंने क्या बोला था कि जैसे अगर आपको पता चल गया कि साइक्लिसिटी आ गई आ गई फोर और अगर किसी भी पावर को आप फोर से डिवाइड करोगे सो व्हाट वुड बी पॉसिबल रिमाइंडर्स द पॉसिबल रिमाइंडर्स आर एज फॉलोज आइदर इट इज गोना बी वन और टू और थ्री और द रिमाइंडर इज गोइंग टू बी द जीरो बी जीरो एंड व्हाट वुड बी द लास्ट डिजिट इन दैट केस इन ऑर्डर टू फाइंड आउट द लास्ट डिजिट आई वुड से दैट दिस इज सेवन इज टू पार्ट सेवन सेवन इज टू पार्ट वन विच इज सेवन एंड सेवन इज टू पार्ट टू ओवर हेयर विच इज विच इज नाइन and 7 is to power 3 that is going to be 3 and over here the last digit is going to be 1 that is what we did for the cyclicity of 2 and cyclicity of 3 and similarly in the cyclicity of 7 we are getting the we are getting that this is 4 and these are going to be the possibilities now if you understand this thing i would take only one or two problems over here now and i would say that what is going to be the last digit over here In order to find out last digit, I just said that because the the cyclicity of seven is four over here, this power should be divided by four. And if the power will have to be divided by four, we know that divisibility rule of four is the last two digits must be divisible by by four. So this question, in this question, I would say that this gets discarded. and this becomes this 7 is to power 23 and if i need to find out what is going to be the digit at unit place in 7 is to power 23 i will be dividing 23 by 23 by 4 why by 4 you understand because cyclicity of 7 is coming out as as 4 agar aapne isko divide kar diya to aapko kya milega 
यहां पे आ गया ट्वेंटी और यहां पे आ गया यहां पे आ गया थ्री यानी कि ये थ्री आ गया आपका रिमाइंडर कई सारे लोग इसी को बोल के आते हैं कि यही हमारा रिमाइंडर है नो वट इज गोइंग टू बी द रिमाइंडर द रिमाइंडर इज सेवन इज टू पार्ट थ्री विच विच ऑब्वियसली इज कमिंग आउट एज थ्री तो कभी कभी क्या होता है कि कॉन्सेप्ट भले ही गड़बड़ कर दिया बट आंसर सही है आता है बट देन योर अनालिसिस हैज टू बी परफेक्ट यू हैज टू बी क्रिस्टल क्लियर तो दैट इज हाउ यू कैन फाइंड आउट द सेक्लिसिटी ऑफ सेवन राइट एक प्रॉब्लम और ले लेते हैं सो दैट सो दैट द थिंग्स गेट क्लियर आई वुड से दैट आई हैव गॉट आई हैव गॉट स्टेट समथिंग एल्स आई वुड से दैट वन टू सेवन एंड Seven two one. What is going to be the digit at unit place in this number? Now you understand this twelve is discarded and this seven is discarded. What is that we are having? Seven is to power twenty one. And if we have seven is to power twenty one, this twenty one when divided by when it when it is divided by four, what is the remainder will it give? It will give one as the remainder. And because one is the remainder, what is going to be the digit at unit place? It is seven is to power one, which is which is seven. it's so so simple to understand this thing right now what is going to be the cyclicity of 8 uh, these cyclicities are something that we need to know right agar yaad karke log bolte hain ki sir hamare ko yaad karne ki zarurat hai kya no you don't even have to remember them all aap to pen chalao na apne aap usi samay 3 4 second ke andar mein wo nikal ke aa jayega jaise agar hamare ko nikalna ho ki what is going to be the cyclicity of 8 and i would say this is 8 and then what is going to be 8 square this is 64 and 8 is to power 3 is coming out as 5.2 and 8 is to power 4 is 4096 now understand this thing if i need to find out 8 is to power 5 this unit place 6 will have to be multiplied by 8 and 8 into 6 is coming out as again 8 so the cyclicity is repeating itself so in order to find out what is going to be the digit at Unit place in eight is to power six. I would say that eight into eight, which is four. In case of eight is to power seven, that's going to be two. And in case of eight is to power eight, that again is coming out as that again is coming out as eight. So what is the cyclicity of what is the cyclicity of eight? The cyclicity of eight is coming out as four. And if the cyclicity is four, आपने यही तो सीखा है. कि आप पावर्स को क्या कर दोगे फोर से डिवाइड कर दोगे और अगर आप पावर्स को फोर से डिवाइड करोगे तो आपके पास में पॉसिबिलिटीज कितनी आएंगी रिमाइंडर्स कितने आएंगे रिमाइंडर्स वुड बी फ्रॉम फ्रॉम वन एंड टू एंड देन थ्री एंड जीरो एंड इफ दिस इज द केस व्हाट वुड बी द लास्ट डिजिट वट वुड बी द लास्ट डिजिट एंड आई वुड से लास्ट डिजिट ओवर हेयर विल बी एट इज टू पार वन विच इज एट एंड एट इज टू पार टू विच इज विच इज फोर And eight is to power three, which is two. And over here, eight is to power four. That that you can take as that you can take as six. As simple as that, right? Now, uh, by now, मेरे को तो ये boring काम लगने लगता है कि second city बार बार निकालनी है और बार बार ये चीज़ चक्कर नहीं है. But एक बार अगर ये कर लेंगे ना, तो बाकी के problems लगाने बड़े आसान हो जाएंगे. जैसे जैसे अगर मेरे को यहाँ पे निकालना हुआ, what is what is eight is to power five eighty two. What is going to be the last digit over here? And I will say that th this is pretty much similar to this problem because the cyclicity of eight is four, and the power will have to be divided by four. And if we will have to divide the power by four, we will be concentrating only on the last two digits, which is fifty-two. Now try to understand this. Fifty-two is completely divisible by four. Fifty-two is completely divisible by four. So remainder is zero. If the remainder is zero, what is going to be digit at unit place? I would say that there are people who will say that eight is to power zero. No, it is not eight is to power zero. Zero tells you that it is completely and totally divisible. Or as a case, me, you will do what? Eight is to power four. Ka last digit, how much? Six. How much? ये आएगा यूनिट प्लेस पे डिजिट इज दैट ओके द ओनली मिसकॉन्सेप्शन दैट पीपल गेट इज इज ओवर हियर अदरवाइज the entire theory is pretty much simple is that right okay now the last number that we will have to deal with is 9 what is going to be 9 is to power 1 which is 9 how about 9 square 81 the moment you get 1 iska matlab kya ho gaya ye cyclicity apne aap ko repeat kar jayegi jaise 3 ke case mein kaha tha 3 was 3 9 27 and 
and after 81 it was repeating itself right because 81 into 3 is 243 in the case of 7 it started with 7 and then 49 and 343 and 2401 2401 the last place is 1 वहां से साइड बाय फिर से अपने आप को रिपीट कर जाएगी जैसे अगर आपको 9 to power 3 निकालना है हुआ तो आंसर 729 हो गया इजंट इट 9 to power 4 निकालना हुआ दैट pretty much simple similar to this one so it kehne ka matlab kya ho gaya 9191 i would say that the cyclicity of 9 is 2 or i would i would simplify and i would say that 9 is to power any odd number will give me the last digit will be nothing but 9 and 9 is to power any even number will give me the last digit as as 1 so if i need to find out what is what is 19 is to power 19 what is the last digit of 19 is to power 19 and i say that 19 ka 1 gaya to bacha kitna 9 is to power 19 which is nothing but 9 is to power an odd number and if 9 is to power an odd number so what is going to be digit at unit pace digit as unit pace will be nothing but 9 but a simple sa concept hua so ab aapko kya karna hai kyunki ab aapne seekh liya ki 2 se leke 9 tak ki divisibility uh, sorry cyclicity hoti kya hai right and 1 ki cyclicity everybody says that 1 ki cyclicity kitni hoti it is always 1 1 is to power any number is always 1 so what did we learn over here is if if you have a 2 the cyclicity of 2 is the cyclicity of 2 is 4 which is 2 4 8 and 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 6 the cyclicity of 3 is coming out as as 4 again this number was nothing but 3 9 7 and 1 cyclicity of 4 was 2 4 is to power any odd number and 4 is to power any even number will be 4 and 6 respectively the cyclicity of 5 and 6 is 1 uh, they are pretty simple to understand 5 is to power any number is 5 and 6 is to power any number even odd it doesn't matter this is 6 how about how about cyclicity of 7 the cyclicity of 7 is coming out as 4 which is 7 9 3 and 1 and and the cyclicity of 8 we figured out is 8 which is 8 4 2 and and 6 and the cyclicity of 9 was 2 which is 9 is to power an odd number was 9 and 9 is to power any even number was 1 so this is what we learned in this video uh, how about how about other problems uh, problems like problems like these uh, we would be dealing with these problems in the third video in video number one and in video number two we talked about the we talked about the basic concepts and in the third video we would be going ahead and solving those kind of problems which is competitive examination mein actually pucha jata hai right so watch this video video number three in this series and i hope that all your concepts all your doubts will get cleared over here right so thank you very much for watching this one guys bye bye and take care